Tonight's education report sponsored by Midland College. Registration for Hector County ISD is opening online July 1st. Now school staff are ready to get those students enrolled. I sat down with school leaders about what parents need to know. ETISD's registration is all online this year. It's required for all new and returning students. Students with a new address will need to upload a change of address verification form as well. On July 1st, there will be an icon at the top of the ECISD website, and parents can click on the registration icon. It will take parents through a series of questions and lead them through the registration process. Alicia Severson, the Assistant Superintendent of Student and School Support, says the process should be fairly simple for families to navigate. In terms of transfers, so if parents attend a certain school and they just want to change schools, they haven't moved, they just want to attend a different school, um, that transfer window has actually closed and all transfers that have been approved, families have already been notified. For completely new students, the same applies. For students who have moved to Odessa from outside of Odessa, let's say Midland, Lubbock, or any surrounding area, um, new students to ECISD can also enroll through the same process. Another piece of important information, if families are new um, to ECISD, we do encourage them, while the registration process is very simple, we do encourage families to reach out to the school just to let the school know that they will be coming if they are not a current student in ECISD. Choice schools are also still an option as well. So for families that live in one school zone but might want to attend one of our 13 choice schools that all have a unique focus, um, parents can still go online and apply to attend choice schools. The first day of school will have staggered start dates. We are excited to receive students in pre-K through 6th and 9th grade, August 9th, and all of the grade levels will join us on August 11th.